everyone hope you are all well my name is brandon tilly from smart business solutions taking you through today the steps required to record the receipt of your job keeper payments from the ato these are my contact details here um, if you've got any questions once you watch the video probably the best way to get in touch is via email and we can set up a call if we need to and go through the issues you've got so look, hopefully by now everyone has received their April 2020 payment from the ATO for the JobKeeper program. Um, this video will hopefully provide some clarity on how you can uh, reconcile that whilst doing your bookkeeping. So first thing we'll go through today is creating a new revenue account via the chart of accounts. We'll then go through accessible income um, and cover off on why this payment is GST free and how to ensure you are recording it that way. And then finally, we'll go through the bank reconciliation. So if I jump into zero, we're gonna to go to accounting and chart of accounts. I'm gonna to come to this revenue tab here. And what we're gonna do is add an account that will show up like these ones do. So come up to add an account. Now the account type is revenue, the code, I'm just gonna put in 275, keep it in line. So call it other revenue, JobKeeper. The description, we might just put JobKeeper payments received from the ATO. And look, as I said, the most important part here is ensuring the GST settings are right. So we want it to be GST free income. Once that's done, we're gonna save it. The reason for that being GST free income um, is the money going out is paid as wages. There's no GST attached to wages. So the money coming in, we don't want any GST attached to. We just want the net effect on the accounts to be zero. Um, that way we don't have to pay extra tax at the end of the financial year. So we're gonna come now into the reconcile section. We scroll down here, we'll see 10th of May, we received $9,000 from the ATO. So we're just gonna put the ATO in there. I'm going to pay it to that account, to the 275. In the description, I just like to put a quick description of the month it was received for, and then OK. So quite a quick video there and a straightforward process. Um, like I said at the start, if you've got any questions, don't hesitate to shoot me an email. Um, and we can go from there. Thank you.